All right, this is our first full day in Bali. We just woke up, a, well, not just. Jojo and Grace have been up for a little while. We've been having fun playing with toys and they were cooking. I should have filmed that I didn't think of this morning. They were cooking fantastic food like Frosted Flakes and noodles. It was a delicious delicacy. Uh, they were being so cute at the table. But Ben, Jake, Jojo and Grace and I are on a walk in beautiful Bali. It is definitely warm and humid here. Uh, the moment I stepped outside, I thought, whoa, this is warmer than even Thailand was, I think. But we're just discovering our area here by our villa. I it's a really it's nice really place. Cool. And look at that. They've got their shrines always. It's really cool. Wow, look at all these little statues below each tree. Are they frogs? Yeah, yeah they're frogs. Those are fun. The squirrel's on the shrine. Is he coming to worship? That's awesome. Gracie, do you see him? Is he coming to find food? Is he cute? Oh, he is. He's eating some food right there. Let's eat some food. Is he cute? Speaking of shrines, we learned yesterday that here in Bali, the majority of people are, are Hindu. And it's a different type of Hinduism than in India. It, of course, stemmed from there, but he says it's definitely different. We learned this from our driver last night, Eddie, he was great. And he said that the rest of Indonesia, hello, the rest of Indonesia is uh, mostly Muslim. And so interesting that Bali is Hinduism. Indonesia is huge, it's over a thousand islands. Two million people on this, in this city that we're at. Huge city. Um, so we're excited to discover yeah. Bali and the beauty yeah, of this. Awesome right Don't get wet. I saw Grace, lightning for the first time since like Costa Rica. Grace, Grace, yeah, Jojo, on the plane, wet. huh? Yeah, and I, and I was wondering what would happen Grace, if we no. got struck. Ah, you getting your tootsies wet? Oh boy, Grace. Oh, what happened? Oh, what happened? <laughs> I keep seeing these things in random spots. They Maybe. have different beautiful flowers. I see some crackers, I can see a cigarette. I wouldn't want that offered to me, but that's okay. That's Whoa. what they're offering. Did we have one? Where did we see one? Wait. We had one. On our doorstep, right? Yeah, what? there's another. Oh, there's this, a, yeah. Have, like the talkie thing. Oh, it's got, that's incense. It, it, it seems like they have them at their doors or their entryways. I wonder if it's like a protection for them. Yeah, there's another one right yeah. there, isn't there? And I bet more. And some people have like yellow like flowers. flowers. Yeah. It's probably too sexy to see. Let's ask what and those it's are like about. The very front of their door. Cool. So look, this is a residential area, but there's so much growth here. That's what it would look like around here, guys, if it just grew. It's so lush. So this is right at the entrance. Here's our entrance right next to us here. And we walk out and look how cool, just right in front of us, this cool wall. I like that. Okay, we're going back again. Got some groceries. Was that successful? Yeah. Did it have the water? They put a, like a table out on the floor. Uh huh. Outside, and they put flowers on there, and they put leaves, and they make leaves out of the table. The table is made of those leaves. And guess what? What? Squirrels worship them. <laughs> the squirrels worship the cute little flowers and table thing? That's awesome. Where, everywhere. Where did, oh, I was gonna say, where did you see these? Oh, one's just on our doorstep. One's on our doorstep? Yeah, I'll show you. Okay. Da -da. Oh my goodness. What? That was, who put that there? Just somebody? Mom and I are on our first adventure here in Bali. We're going shopping.
first excursion together shopping at the supermarket. This one, you can tell, is geared more towards foreigners, um, and which is great, especially where, as we've experienced throughout the world, like it's hard to find, like we have to f adjust how we eat everywhere we go because there's just a lot of ingredients that we can't get. And so sometimes it's just really nice to have something you're used to <laughs> in a foreign place. Uh, so I'm sure the prices are more expensive here but we're like, it's all right, because we can get the things that we like. So we can feed our children. Yeah. Not surprised with that though. And it's funny they've got tortillas, Mexican gourmet chili. Well, I've never seen that before. That's kind of cool. Tons of different ketchups. Holy moly. Lots of chips, lots of American chips you can see in other countries. And then their treats. Look at all those. Lots of good cookies. They even have milk in here, I noticed. Milk of cookies. Delicious. Look at this. They've got protein balls. That is the first time I have seen anything like that on our travels actually so far. Okay, so these fancy granolas are like way cheaper than any bunches of oats. It's like nine bucks for honey bunches of oats um, and multigrain Cheerios. It's like eight, almost nine bucks for that. But then we come over here and get like frosted flakes where we can, we've pretty much found them in all Southeast Asian countries that we've been to so far. And these are pretty staple. So that's why this is like two, 290. Um, so it's just crazy to me that the foreigner cereal is so expensive compared to these fancy granolas and stuff. So we really got to watch our pricing because we're like, oh my gosh, honey bunches of oats. But then it's like, wait, that's really expensive for honey bunches of oats. Okay, let's make a different choice. We got lots of breads here. That is also something that is hard for us to find in Southeast Asia. Once again, they told us this is the store is like geared towards foreigners and so I'm sure that's why. Okay, so the bread actually looks pretty good and it's not as expensive as I would think. It's like $2 for a loaf of bread, not bad. Look at this, coconut peanut butter, almond butter, cashew butter, coconut butter. Now they're speaking our language, right? My language. Oh, check this out, they even have Bell flour. Isn't that crazy? Oh flour, rye flour. This is crazy, it's awesome. I feel like I'm shopping at like a fancy health food store, uh, international store. Like it's, this is kind of a fun store. Swiss yogurt. Swiss yogurt. It's delicious. The, it's the kind that we found in the Philippines that's Swiss. Made in Switzerland. <laughs> and they have like normal cheese. Look, they got oval team. That's awesome. Woo! Look how full our cart is already. Holy schmackadoli. We're gonna get a dragon fruit this time. Thought these tons in Thailand, so 
it's time. We need to get one of our own. Try a new kind of apple. We usually get gala apples because they're my favorite, like by far. But I'm feeling adventurous today. Kids love green apples. Grace loves her avocado, especially the bigger the better for her. Yeah. For us, like we love garlic salt flavored stuff and it's hard to find garlic salt and it's sometimes hard to find garlic and so we're finally gonna pack this around with us. But I can't believe how full our cart is and I'm pretty sure we will plow through most of this. Okay, we bought so much, we needed two carts. <laughs> Lots of good food. I bet they'll go for cereal first, that's my guess. Or wrong. Yeah, probably cereal. Can you hear the kids? Mommy and Daddy are home. Hey guys! Got lots of food. There's two more bags out there. Two. Oh, you guys got the heavy bags. Woo! Are you? Nice job. Thanks. We got the. That was a fun store. We are only a 15-minute walk to the beach from our Airbnb, and we've got maybe hour and a half of daylight left. So we're gonna head to the beach and maybe rent surfboards, maybe just play in the waves. I don't know what we're gonna do. Surfboard. But we're gonna just head to the beach and see what we can do before the sun goes down. Hopefully it won't pour rain on us.
Peace is trying so hard to stop the war. She's trying to bring peace to the battle. <laughs> it's my favorite. It's so cute. We gotta eat well, some you dinner. You like the pizza. Yeah, the pizza is fantastic. Look at Mama's. Oh, look at the tiny little salad. <laughs> That's funny. The pizzas are big and fantastic. The pastas are very small portions. So if you come here, don't get pasta. The pizza, the pizza is fantastic. You are loving your pasta, aren't you? She is scarfing it down. You're pounding it, Grace. <laughs> you love it? You're so cute. Yeah. Look at that. She had a full plate and she ate it all, so I gave her the rest of mine and she just keeps going. This pizza was so good that we decided to get another one because it just is so delicious. We're a little bit hungry. 